Hi, this is Leah Klein, health and homeless coach. And today my question for you is, are you seeking God? Our verse is Isaiah 55, 6. Seek the Lord while he may be found. Call upon him while he is near. Are you seeking God? How are you seeking God? What ways of doing that are you using? Hopefully you're using you know, daily quiet time. Um, that is key. Bible studies, um, whether on your own or especially with other people. Um, there's benefits to doing it with others because you can get insights through somebody else's learning and uh, what the Spirit's giving them uh, that adds to what, you know, is being directly given to you. Uh, however, those aren't the only ways. Those are the ways we think about and we're more likely already doing. But as I you know, previously mentioned uh, in my videos, a personal retreat, which is a quiet one-on-one -on -one time with God in his creation, ideally, is a different level. <laughs> if you want to up-level your relationship with God, your connection with him, feeling his presence, it is really in a lot of ways, the ultimate seeking God experience. And my experience in my dad's experience, uh, that's why my dad wrote the book, Face to Face, uh, Meeting God in the Quiet Places. Um, and it is a unique uh, experience to get away from the noise of our lives and to take some time one-on-one -on -one with him. Now, obviously, you can do this where you are. Uh, there are some things to help make it work better. But lots of times I find that people may have a concept of this, but they don't actually do it. They might have done one at one time, but they haven't put it on their calendar to do it regularly. It's not become a discipline, a spiritual discipline. And that is why for the people that have just never done it before and those that need something external to put something on their calendar is why I offer guided personal retreats. And I actually have a group one day event coming up on May 21st. It is in person, it is local to me. So if you're at the other end of the country, that might not work for you. But uh, as I said, May 21st, it's on, gonna be on uh, Mount Lemon, basically. Um, and technically at the foot of Mount Bigelow part of it, but it's, it's all kind of part of one mountain. Uh, and we're going to be probably 10 to 20, mostly women, probably. Um, and we're going to come together with that common theme of spending, learning together and spending time one on one with God, away from the cell phones, away from the emails, away from Twitter and Facebook and all of that, and cutting out all those noises that stop us from hearing Him. Because most of the time, God does not shout at you. Uh, most of the time, God does not slap you up the side of the head because you're not getting what he's trying to tell you. Sometimes, <laughs> sometimes he does. But it's a lot more pleasant experience to get quiet and actually hear that still small voice. So to this week, I want to encourage you to seek God in prayer and ask him how you could seek him better and maybe in a different way than what you are already doing. So I wanna wrap us up with, I will post a, a um, brochure in the 
in the feed for this video and I will also post about the retreat you know in the group and in send out emails about this so keep an eye out for more information I do need people to sign up if they're going to go and there is a cost because there is a cost uh, to putting it together there is uh, location fees and food uh, there is a meal provided so anyway to wrap us up uh, I want to end with the song Step by Step, and I want to encourage you to sing along if you know it. If you want, you can just listen and just join me if you want to. Oh, and remember my tune here, here. Oh God, you are my God, and I will ever praise you. Oh God, you are my God, and I will ever praise you. I will seek you in the morning, and I will learn to walk in your ways. And step by step, you'll lead me, and I will follow you all of my days. See you next week with another verse and keep an eye out for more information on the retreat. If you're remotely close to Arizona, uh, check out uh, that information and um, come and join us. It'll be a great time of connection and spiritual growth, both with God and with fellow believers. See you later.